There are a few ways to move an NPC along a path, so be sure to play around with the tools to find what works best for you and your mission. In this tutorial, we'll detail one of the most common methods to make an NPC follow a path. To make an NPC follow a path, you'll need two groups, one for the NPC and one for the path. For the purposes of this tutorial, I'll be calling them Dude and Path1. For more information on creating groups, check out our group tutorial video. Before you build your path, you'll want to scope out where you want Dude to go, as well as the path you want him to take. One thing to keep in mind is that path points behave more like objects and other logic boxes. This is because path points are required to be assigned to a group. Choose path point from the create menu. Remember that the arrows indicate the direction the NPC will move. Target the path point and press triangle to extend the path. It's also possible to extend the path by selecting extend path on the path points action wheel. Now you can press square to place consecutive path points. When creating paths around corners, make sure you place enough so dude will walk in a smooth arc. When you're finished, press X to place the final path. Once the path has been completed, enter its edit menu and change its tag to path 1. Now that your path has been created, you need to place the NPC you want to follow it. You can pick any NPC you'd like, citizens, militia, Zeke, so go ahead and place the desired NPC near the path. Just remember to change its tag, just like we did for dude. Now that your NPC and path are in place, you'll need to create the logic that'll get the NPC moving. You can use a monitor or a volume as the conditional trigger to get the NPC to move along the path, but for the purposes of this tutorial, I'll be using a monitor. Enter the monitor's edit menu to set the condition. In this case, the monitor will be set to mission start. Now all you need is a script command. Just remember that once the NPC reaches the end of the path, they'll revert to their default behavior. Go ahead and place a script command and enter its edit menu. This is where you tell Dude to follow path 1. Shift the action setting to move along path and change the first who what setting to Dude. Shift the move speed setting to run or walk and the second who what to path 1. Press X to accept the changes to the logic. The final step is to connect the logic boxes. Simply target the monitor and press triangle to extend the wire and plug it into the script command. Press X to secure the connection, and there you have it. The smart text will read, when the mission starts, tell dude to move along path one. To test your mission, enter the action wheel's main menu and select one of the play mission options. As soon as the mission starts, the NPC will be moving along the path, just like you told him to. So this is just one of the ways to move an NPC along a path. Spend some time playing around with the script command, or try out the object modifier's patrol option. Both methods are a great way for sending an NPC along a path. Thanks for checking out our tutorials. Be sure to visit the infamous two UGC forums for the latest contests and in-depth tutorials. PlayStation.